A capsized boat and an unresponsive man found today off Long Beach, and tonight we learned that man had died. CBS 2's Rachel Kim is live in Long Beach, has more for us. Rachel. Yeah, Jeff and Pat, we're at Marine Stadium, and behind us you can see the boat was towed ashore here. And yes, sadly, we've learned from the Long Beach Fire Department that the man who was pulled from the boat earlier today has passed away, and Long Beach police tell us he was a drowning victim. Sky 2 was over the waters off the Long Beach coast after a reported capsized boat at the Federal Breakwater. That's about a mile and a half out from Alamitos Bay. Firefighters believe the boat might have crashed. The Long Beach Fire Department tells us soon after a distress call went out just before 5 p.m., rescue boats saw the 21 foot power vessel overturned. Rescue divers went into the water and pulled an unresponsive man in his 50s from the hull of the boat. He was taken to the hospital. Then the search was on for any other possible. Victims. We had rescue boats, we had rescue divers, we had uh, uh, our helicopters in the air, uh, and a drone as well. And we, there was a little bit of a debris field, and we, after a couple of hours, determined that the primary and secondary search was complete, and there were no other occupants in that vessel. After investigators got what they needed out in the water, salvage operations began, and the damaged boat was towed back to shore. Long Beach Fire says, based on the debris field, investigators say it's a possibility the boat was going at a high rate of speed when it hit the breakwater. But the cause of this accident is still under investigation. Yeah, again, still under investigation by the Coast Guard and Long Beach Police. As for the man who passed away, he has not been publicly identified. Reporting live tonight in Long Beach, Rachel Kim, CBS 2 News.